Today, we are going to examine a story from Daniel chapter 2, where King Nebuchadnezzar, the ruler of Babylon, had a profoundly disturbing dream. He summoned his magicians, astrologers, and wise men to interpret the dream, but he insisted that they first reveal the content of the dream without him providing any details. The wise men failed to fulfill the king's request, leading Nebuchadnezzar to issue a decree for the execution of all the wise men of Babylon, including Daniel and his friends. However, upon learning about the decree, Daniel approached the king and requested some time to interpret the dream. Daniel and his friends prayed to God to unveil the mystery, and during the night, God revealed the dream to Daniel through a vision. When Daniel stood in front of the king, he began by acknowledging that no human possessed the ability to disclose the meaning of the dream, but that it resided solely with God in heaven. Daniel then proceeded to explain the dream and its interpretation. Here is the summary and what each of the kingdoms is believed to represent. 1. Head of Gold, symbolizes the Babylonian Empire, renowned for its opulence and prosperity under the rule of King Nebuchadnezzar. 2. Chest and Arms of Silver, represents the Medo-Persian Empire, which conquered Babylon and exerted its control through economic power. 3. Waist and Thighs of Bronze, signifies the Greek Empire, led by Alexander the Great, known for its military conquests and influential culture. 4. Legs of Iron, depicts the Roman Empire, characterized by its strength and dominance over extensive territories. 5. Feet of Iron and Clay, represents the modern nations of Europe, symbolizing a combination of strength and weakness, as well as the inability to achieve complete unity. 6. The Rock, symbolizes the kingdom of Jesus Christ, destined to overthrow and replace all earthly kingdoms, ushering in a realm characterized by love and peace. Upon hearing Daniel's interpretation, Nebuchadnezzar acknowledged the greatness of Daniel's God and bestowed upon him gifts and promotions. The king proclaimed that Daniel's God as the supreme deity in ruling over kings. This narrative serves as a testament to Daniel's wisdom, unwavering faith in God, and his exceptional talent for interpreting dreams with divine insight. Furthermore, it underscores the central theme of God's sovereignty, illustrating his ultimate authority over the fortunes and declines of nations throughout the course of history. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe.